Thank you, James. After undergoing renovations, the Genesee County Animal Control opened the doors to its new facility today. The expansion of the 40-year-old building improves conditions for the animals while adding upgrades to provide them with better care. TV5's Rachel McQuarrie takes us inside to see those changes. What does it mean to be open? Well, we get to return a lot of dogs back to their homes, which is wonderful. After a 10-day closure, the Genesee County Animal Control is opening back up. Services were suspended as the animal shelter was making room for another phase of its expansion. We are now into kennels. It was kind of eerie not to hear the dogs barking throughout the day. Deputy Director Renee Kennedy says while they are open, there is still plenty of progress to make. Moving forward, a lot still needs to be done. Seven wards that are being completely gutted that will all turn to kennels that will eventually be adoptable dogs. We'll also have the whole front half of the building and where our old admin was at, and that will be adoptable cats. Kennedy says during the renovation closure, they moved all of the animals into new kennels, as you can see here. Stray animals in their brand new, much larger, hopefully temporary homes. They're much more relaxed, their anxiety is lower, so that is uh, a joy and a long time coming for both staff and volunteers. Over the next few months, the old part of the facility will be gutted to make room for more animals and other state-of-the-art equipment. Kennedy couldn't be happier with the amount of support the shelter has received. It's all, it's the millage, it's the taxpayers, it's the support from our county commissioners, it's the volunteers in our community, and it is staff that comes that chooses to come here Tireless, tirelessly every day and and work with these animals. And here at Animal Control, they're hoping to finish all of the renovations by the holidays. In Genesee County, Rachel McCrary, WNEM TV5.